my own incredible time machine. That penny off a boy with a baby that I love. Hey, timekeeper! What? What am I in here? Scrap metal? Come on, introduce me! Oh, pardon moi. I'd like you all to meet my assistant. She's bold, she's brassy, she's self contained all the way from Cleveland, Ohio. Please welcome the self programming circumvisual photo droid. Let's say hello to Nine Eye. Okay, enough of this chit chat. Let's get ready to break the time barrier. That's right, my friends. No longer are we limited to traveling from place to place and losing our bags beforehand. Now, with my time machine, it is possible to travel from time to time. Enough explaining. Hit the switch. We're almost ready to go. Just a few last minute details. You know, this thing looked a lot safer in the blueprints, bud. It's perfectly safe. You have absolutely nothing to worry about. Raising neutrino shield. Yeah, if this gizmo's so safe, what are you doing with that neutrino shield? Oh, nothing. It's just a little design flourish. Ha, don't worry. Lead lined underwear. Check. Laser gun targeted. Check. Whoa, watch where you point that thing. It worked! <laughs> and they left to be back at university. Maybe it's because of the tutu. Well, you're doubting autonomous. You ready to make some history? I'm ready, I'm ready. Let's go! I'll decide when we're ready to go. We're ready to go. Lost a miserable little piece of metal. Hey, I heard that. Where am I? Don't worry, Nine Eye. You're safe and sound in the um, Triassic period. I'm opening my eyes. I better like what I see. Oh, no, you're too far back. These controls are so sensitive. I barely touched. <laughs> Big teeth, brain the size of a wall. No problem, I've got it. Oh, great joke for you. How many Neanderthals to take a light of fire? None. They don't have it. <laughs> I've got to 12,000 years ago, the last great ice age. Fabulous. Oh, daiquiris for everybody. How about a hot cup of antifreeze? I'm icing up here. Ow! Oh, I can't wait to get back to And here we are. 1450, a demonstration of Gutenberg's printing press. Oh, the Gates. We are not Germany. And left is a whole new fashion thing. Look at those skirts. It must be cold. And no one's wearing underwear. Tough guys, eh? Get away from the nine eyes. Come on, give you a glass of kiss. Ah! Right between the eyes! I got you, Nine Eye. I got you. The Renaissance! My machine works! I get the grant. <laughs> Quick, follow that Mona Lisa. You always did have a thing for historical figures. You're going to meet a true visionary. One of my personal heroes, Leonardo da Vinci. Perché io il fatto è la macchina di tempo. To go. Oh, great souvenir! No, no! Don't touch that! Put it back! You don't know where that's been. Put it back. Hey, Mona, take five. He's drawing me. Oh, look, over there. Oh, gravity works. Ciao, ragazzo. That's Mozart. Yes, Amadeus himself. Today's his seventh birthday. He's playing his own minuet in G. Isn't it fabulous? And over there's little Louis XVI with his head still on. Ha, 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 ha. Way to go, Wolfie. Way to go. Yes. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying, I'm trying. Uh, hurry, hurry, they can see me. Try to blend in. Think chandelier. Think France. Think Chardonnay going tomorrow. I am blending in. I am blending in. Will you stop posing? We have to go now. I am not blending in. I am not blending in. Boy, am I not blending in. Timekeeper, fix this right now. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Oh, I pulled something. Oh, what's happening? I'm sending you to the press exposition, but it's stuck on fast forward. Well, look at that. Isn't that a great affair? I planned it that way, I really did. Look out, I'm gonna throw my circuit breakers. I should save this for the next show. Okay, what are we doing here? Nine Eye, this is something I've wanted to see my whole life. Exposition Universelle de Paris, 1900. Speak English. The Universal Exposition of Paris, 1900. We're about to meet two of my greatest heroes, H.G. Wells and Jules Verne. So where are what am I, a map? Oh, look, here comes Mr. Wells. But I don't see Jules Verne. Watch out, move closer, blend in, mingle, mingle, mingle. Don't just hover, don't just hover, blend. Yes, see, Monsieur Verne. Yeah, look, right there, there he is. A man right. with his head in the stars. <laughs> Jules Verne. Monsieur Verne, permit me to present Monsieur H.G. Wells. Monsieur Wells. The honor is mine, sir. Oh, and mine too, sir. Your work, Mr. Wells, caused quite a sensation. Particularly the time oh, machine. Yes, the time machine. 
I brought along a model for La Conference. Aha. Uh -huh. I spent my life writing about the possible, and you prefer the impossible. Impossible? No, sir. This may be improbable, but believe me, it's not impossible. Good reply. What point? Have you travelled through time? Have I ever travelled through time? Uh, I have travelled through time as often as you have travelled from the Earth to the Moon, sir. Yes. Easy, boys. Too much coffee. Time machine. We have only ten minutes until the conference begins. Well, we'll continue this, Monsieur Verne. I'll be in turn. <laughs> time travel. It's impossible. Oh yeah. Look again, Frenchie. No, no, that's it. You're grounded. I told you not to here. I'm bringing you back right now. Hey, I watched that. Hey, would you get your paws off me? You're smudging my glossy finish. Timekeeper! Don't worry, relax. It's under control. No problems. Oh, no! What have I done? into a Reddit teller. I'm sorry, you're overdrawn. I must be dreaming. <laughs> dreaming? <laughs> this is a nightmare. Who are you? Timekeeper. Just a guy who probably destroyed history by bringing you here. Where is here? It's the future, Mr. Byrne. I've got to send you back. No, wait. All my life, I dreamed of the future. You must have missed it. It is pretty wonderful. Maybe... No, I can't. No, I can't. Yes, I can. No, I can. No, I can. Yes, I can. No, I can. Listen, you have a speech in ten minutes. Plenty of time. But I cannot guarantee your safety. We're not covered for this, really. I take my chances. I think you better go back. With Tinselhead here at the controls, you're gonna be French toast by breakfast. Listen, Blakey! I know exactly what I'm doing! Now, Monsieur Verne, tell me, what would you like to see? Everything. Way to go, Jules! Monsieur Verne, I proudly show you the modern world! In ten minutes left. So this is the future. It's very dark. You know, I've never been able to read these timetables. He does know what he's doing. Occasionally. Uh -huh. Don't like that noise. Oh, that's not what I think it is! What happened? Where's Jules? I got him on the train. Didn't see inside. Picky, picky. Well, I'll move you in closer. Way to go, Tinhead. You turned Jules for into a hot ornament. Oops, I don't know.
will have a brief moment in the English countryside with someone named Trevor. Hello, Trevor! Take care! We're heading for that aqueduct. And here we are. Wow! This is it, Julie. The big airport. New York, New York. A city of 10 million dreams. And one parking space. It's fantastic! Timekeeper for an extraordinary voyage. Extraordinary for me as well, sir. No, no. You are a most charming guide. You aren't so bad yourself, Jules. If I ever come back, I'm definitely going to look you up. I don't believe what I'm seeing. This is impossible. Improbable? <laughs> impossible, no. Mr. 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 Burley. Come on, come on. Yeah. Come on. You know, I'm really gonna miss that guy. I'll miss him too, Nine Eye, but there's still one place we haven't seen. Ladies and gentlemen, now that we know my time machine operates flawlessly, who would like to travel into the future? Hold it. You're putting people in this thing on purpose? Chill, Blinky. I'm on a roll. Now, any volunteers? Step right up, don't be afraid. Push yourself through a massive time warp continuum. Please, no Disney employees. Anybody? Oh, fabulous! <laughs> Come on down! Uh -huh. There's the pioneer spirit. I hope you're insured. I hope you're in your eyes, Chet. Now, prepare for the most fantastic journey of your life. Okay, let her rip. Here we go! myself sometimes. <laughs> well, to this future dude, you're history people. In the future, anything is possible. <laughs> hey, wait for me! Well, time flies, and now I'm going to go browse to the library at Alexandria. Check up on Columbus before he got to Ohio. Give Freud a piece of my mind and say, Edbush, Medibush. Okay, show's up for get out of here, you little numbskulls. I love you. Thank you for coming today. Get out! <laughs> 